Anyway, they had a, vegans had a significant increased risk of hip of, um, of osteoporosis related hip fractures wow. compared to non vegans. And they thought it was that the non-vegan meters were bigger and had more muscle. They were larger people, and maybe that's why, but it really wasn't. When you analyze the diet that the vegans were eating, it was like a starch-based, like a potato-based or bread-based vegan diet, and their protein content of their diet was 43 grams a day And the in, in this study. And the average calcium intake was 596 milligrams of calcium. And the, the diet was like whole grains and fruit and bean burgers and baked potato and salad with brown rice and dairy-free ice cream and peas and carrots. That was their diet. When I compared that to a nutritarian diet, obviously, where we, instead of we, we have, you know, super seed oatmeal, salad, soup, vegetable stir fry, you know, beans and ice cream with nuts in it, and we just, just a little bit more, same amount of calories. We're talking here about um, 1,600, 1,600 calories compared to 1,600 calories, same amount of calories. The nutritarian diet had double the protein almost double, 40, 84 grams of protein, which is about 19% protein, whereas the vegan diet of people eating, the, vegan, the typical vegan diet of the people analyzing this UK Oxford study, Epic Oxford study, Epic Oxford study, right, um, published in November 2020. Um, they were eating 43 grams of pro uh, protein. The, the nutritarian diet gave 84 grams of protein. The calcium was, I said, was about 600 on the, on the starch-based diet. And the nutritarian diet was 1,291, almost 1,300 milligrams of calcium, more than double the amount of calcium, almost double the amount of protein. So we're saying here, yeah, um, a vegan diet not properly designed can be marginally low in calcium and protein. But you properly design it by using beans and, and nuts and seeds and green vegetables, and you pump it up to be even better. Than, by the way, the animal product diet, the meat eaters, only had 16.5 to 17% protein, whereas the nutritarian diet had 18 to, had 19, average 19% protein. It had more protein, more protein grams for, for 1,600 calories than the, one, than the meat eating diet, because the meat diet probably still eating bread and all salad oils and, you know, they weren't in sugar. They probably not eating this carefully. So, wow. yeah.